Yo, what's going on boys? I'm going to be playing some Phoenix Expo today. I'm 6-0 in the GC, so I'll try to get to 12 wins. Hopefully go 12-0, but yeah, if you enjoyed the video, please make sure to like and subscribe. And I can't really think of a bad matchup. I guess E-Giant, because you don't really have like a small building to pull the E-Giant. You only have an Expo. And the Golden Knight also gets a lot of value, so yeah. Only E-Giant's the bad matchup for this deck. I just took out the Mortar and put in the Expo, so it should work. Because, I mean, a lot of cards in this deck are really broken, like the Knight, Archers, Ice Spirit, Phoenix, even the Miner. Miner needs a nerf, in my opinion, but people are not ready to hear that yet, so. Gonna go for a Miner on the Tower. I was thinking about a Poison, but I don't really want to Poison anymore, because it might be an overcommit. On second thought, probably should have done it, because I would have hit the Lumberjack, too. That would have been a really nice Poison, but it's okay. Gonna go for an Ice Spirit in the middle, and then just gonna pull that low. Oh, did I miss the pull? Yeah, I think I missed the pull. Okay, whatever. Gonna go for a Knight on the Lumberjack. Or not the Lumberjack, the Marcher. I missed the Lumberjack, though, so I got two shots on my tower, but it's okay. Should be able to come back from this, because he's playing the classic bridge spam deck without a Monk, so I'll be fine. I'm going to go for a Log on the Bandit here to finish it off. I don't want it charging into my tower. If he goes Ram, I'm going to have to go for, like, a Phoenix and then Ice Spirit. Actually going to Miner, so if he goes Marcher, I can Phoenix the Marcher out. Actually, I'm going to Archer on it, because I don't want a Phoenix. It's really easy to kite the Phoenix. He might just go for, like, a Barbarrel and kite it opposite lane or something, so... Kind of wanted to go for the archers. I know it's going to Barbarrel, and that's going to get one shot on my tower, but I kind of have to, like, build up my push on the other side, so. I'm going to try to go for an Expo, and just going to see if um, he goes for, like, a Lumberjack. He's probably going to do it, but I don't really want to play anything else, so I might also go for, like, an Eye Drag. If he does go for an Eye Drag, I kind of have to, like, let it lock on the Expo, kill the Eye Drag, and then go for, like, a Miner behind the tower. That way, whatever he places on the Phoenix is going to go behind the tower to hit the Miner, and, yeah, I get damage. Hopefully, though, he might go Bandit High to kite it away, but depends on what he does here. Yeah, really bad Lumberjack. That's going to do, like, two. One more. Three. Okay, I caught up on damage. Nice. I'm going to Poison, actually, to catch up. I know it's not going to kill anything, but I just wanted to catch up, so. Had to go for that Poison. I'm going to Ice Spirit. Just going to go for a uh, Knight in the middle. Don't really want to Archers because I need it for the Ram Rider. I need that really fast DPS. I'm going to Archers on the side and just going to go Log here to kill the Ram. Should not get any damage now. Nice. All right, see what he does here. Honestly, he might try to snipe out that one archer to get the damage. Okay, never mind. It looks like he's not that horny for damage. I'm going to go for uh, x on defense. Yeah, a lot of marcher players like kind of like marcher anything. Even like skellies in the back, they just kind of play it on the on the skelly and get damage. I'm going to go for a minor poison. He did play a fireball on max bow, so it's a really good trade for me. He put everything into that poison too, so I'm getting a lot of value right now. I'm already up damage, I'm slowly coming back, I just need to not take any damage here. I know it's gonna go in soon, so I'm gonna have to like Phoenix and then gonna log it back. Actually gonna Ice Spirit. I was thinking about log, but if I logged, I wouldn't really have enough for like a Knight to block the Marcher, which I kinda needed, so. I'm gonna Expo now, wait, that was a really bad Marcher. He's got Ice Golem though, so I think he's gonna Ice Golem. I'm gonna go for Archers over here. Should kill a Barbarrel, oh wait, that was a really bad Bandit. I'm gonna log the Bandit and get a lock. Nice, that might be the game-winning lock. I'm gonna predict the Lumberjack on the Expo. Nice. To be fair, I think he should have, like, fireballed the 1 HP Expo, knowing that I would have protected it with the Miner, but... It's okay, all good. I won the game, so I'm not really complaining. That puts me at 7-0, so I'll take the win. I'm just gonna hop right in. I'll see you when I find a game. Alright, I'm in a match. 7-0 at the moment. See what deck he's playing. I'm just gonna go for an Ice Spirit to cycle, just to force something out, so that I can find out what deck he's playing. Archers in the back, that doesn't really tell much, because a lot of decks play Archers now, so can't really tell what deck it is. Prince in the back, still can't tell what deck it is, because I don't know what runs um, Archers and Prince. Might be an off meta deck, but oh yeah, it is off meta. Okay, I'm going to have to like Poison on the Graveyard, and then going to have to go for like an Ice Spirit to pull the Prince back. Oh, that didn't jump on the Prince, so kind of a bad Ice Spirit. I think I should have played it on the Archer to make it jump on the Prince as well, but... Yeah, that kind of got some damage. The Archer got some damage on my tower, because I really... Messed up my Ice Spirit. It's okay, though. I'm going to go for... um, kind of want to go for Miner right now, but actually, I'm kind of low on Elixir. I'm not going to go for it. Okay, I'm going to go for it now. They're going to Miner on this spot, so you won't really be able to catch it. Nice. That was a really bad Xe. Kind of a waste. I'm just going to have to go for, like, a Phoenix on it, though, or, like, a Knight to not let him NATO it. I'm pretty sure he has a NATO with the Xe and a Prince, so, yeah. He also has a Graveyard, so probably has, like, NATO Freeze or, like, Arrows or something. I don't really know. But gonna have to find out. Gonna Phoenix here. Just gonna go for like an Axe I was going to say. But I didn't see the Archers in the back. Just gonna go for... uh, Can't even Poison because I know he has a Graveyard. I'm gonna have to like Archers in the back. And then just gonna have to go for an Ice Spirit. Hopefully he does not have Arrows. Because if he does, I think I'm kind of dead right now. Oh boy. Gonna have to log. I could have put the log from the back. But I kind of had to log really fast to get the Prince out of my tower. Or like off my tower. So 
yeah, it kind of sucks, but just gonna have to go for like a minor with this to let it respawn. I don't really know what he has for this. He played the arrows already, so Xy maybe? Oh, he has barbs. Why, why does he have barbs? That's kind of annoying. He has barbs, but good thing is that he's not really back to arrows, so my archers get a lot of value, and then I get to go in with this and then block the Xy and get a lock maybe, but yeah, that's the game plan right now. Unless he pulls out something that I don't know um, he has yet. So just gonna Axe Bow here and just gonna go for like an Ice Spirit to block the Xy. Oh, that's game. He played it in the back and he can't really afford a Prince right now. So, yep, that is going to be GG. I don't think he has a reset. It might have like a freeze or something that I don't know about, but yeah, I just go for it. Gonna log over here to not let that Prince do any damage on my Axe Bow. And just go for an arrow. So I'm gonna Night Archers here to bait the barbs and then just gonna Axe Bow on the left again. The Axe Bow should lock on and I win the game. Oh right, yeah, that was really smart. To be fair, I think I could have just gone for like a, only just a knight to like bait that out, but it's okay. Gonna log here. I didn't really think he was back to archers, but really good archers. He actually got out of that. Yeah, on second thought, probably should have saved my archers for the axe on the left there, but it's okay. I already won the game, so I can definitely afford to make plays like that. I'm not really gonna get punished for it. Gonna poison on the axe here to kill it so that the egg respawns, but he did go for uh, arrows on the egg and the miner. Okay, he played arrows. He can't really like get any damage right now. I just gotta get to a miner and then I'm gonna play it in front of the tower because that's the fastest way to get the tower down. So just gonna do it right now and he might not be able to catch it because I know he has to freeze all this to get the tower right. Yeah, so I'm gonna log and then just gonna knight and the miner takes it out. So I'll take the win 8 0. Kind of an easy game because that was an off meta deck, but hopefully I start facing meta decks now. But yeah, 8 0. I'm just gonna hop right in. Alright, I'm in a match. This game took forever to find, but luckily got a game here facing Larcha. I see what deck he's playing. I'm just gonna go for Archer Split. So it might be minor wall breakers. Magic archer. Okay, so gonna be Remyeli deck. I'm gonna minor on the marcher. Did I miss? Yeah, I think I missed. Oh, that's kinda annoying. And he gets an activation. Okay, that was not the best minor. Um, but I'm gonna have to go for like a knight on the marcher now. Yeah, just gonna play it up high. Oh, yikes. I played that late too. Okay, I'm making a lot of misplays right now, but it's okay. I can afford to take that damage because I have plenty of time to make up for it. I can definitely come back from that, especially when he doesn't have a big spell, so. All I gotta do is really just like surprise him with the axe because he probably thinks I'm playing a mortar right now. So, at some point in the game, if I'm able to like bait out a Valk and then go in opposite lane to block the bomb tower with the knight, I might be able to win the game. But we'll see how that goes. Easier said than done, though. He might have like different ways to defend the axe but who knows? Really good damage on the left there. Though. I had to poison out the marcher. Gonna go for an ice spear. Just gonna go for like the archers on the miner because I don't really want it to get a lot of damage here. It's not really back to marcher, so I don't really have to worry about the snipe right now. Um, see what he does here. Might go Valk or something. I'm just gonna minor on the same spot that he, um, minor. Okay, he kind of caught it because I put it into the skellies, but it's okay. I think I get one shot. No, I don't because he played a Valk. All right, that was a really smart Valk. I don't really know how to defend that because anything I play on this is gonna get March or NATO'd. So I'm just gonna Knight, like, all the way up high. I don't think he can possibly snipe that Knight from that spot. Yeah, okay. I'm good. Gonna have to poison the marcher out. Might go minor wall breakers if he does. I'm gonna have to go for like an ice spear on the wall breakers and then gonna have to go for like archers or something else to DPS it down. My cycle is kind of bad right now. Don't really have a log, so gonna have to watch out. Okay, I'm just gonna let that do the damage. I think this is where I go in. I'm just gonna like archers in the back here. Gonna try to get to my knight and then once I get the knight back, I'm just gonna expo. Okay, I could have just ignored those, but I don't wanna take that damage. Gonna expo now. He might go marcher on the one archer. All right, nice. I was kind of hoping he would actually, because like he'd be down so much elixir, but he played it in the back anyway, so it doesn't matter. He's um, at the same amount of elixir he would be on, even if he played it on the left. I think he just kind of like missed out on the free damage. Ooh, he played that late. I'm gonna go for an ice spirit now. I'm gonna block the bomb tower. Just gonna go for like a phoenix now, and yeah, that should die to my phoenix. And the marcher is going to snipe max, but no, it is not. Really bad placement on it. So yeah, it looks like he was not expecting the expo once again. Kind of worked out because I went in, I play the miner on the marcher block the bomb tower play the ice spirit phoenix on it and then he played a marcher but he kind of messed it up too so yeah i'll take the win um that's gonna put me at like i think nine and oh where is it eight and oh i can't tell i waited a long time i forgot um but should be eight and oh i think yeah it should be eight and oh so i'm just gonna hop right in i will see you when i find a game all right on to my next game here gonna go for an ice spirit to cycle just gonna go for like a miner as well okay might be E-Giant, hopefully not. That matchup is so bad. Okay, yeah, it is going to be E-Giant, so I think I lost already. Kind of want to poison that, but if I do, he goes in, so 
don't really want him to go in. I'm going to knight the middle here to kind of prevent him from going in. And just going to phoenix on his phoenix. Actually going to make it lock on the golden knight. That way I kill it first. And then going to go for like the phoenix on his side. Nice. Going to go for like an expo right about now. And then just going to log out the egg. Because I kind of have to. Oh, I didn't know he had those. If I knew he had those, I definitely would have logged like a little bit to the side to hit those. But it's okay. I think I take some damage here though. Like one reflection, maybe two. Who knows? But just going to knight here. And yeah. Pretty good defense on my end. Um, he didn't get more damage than what I did to him, so I'll be fine. But yeah, I can't really afford to lose right now. I'm 9-0, so I'll try to get to 12-0. But this matchup is really bad, like really, really bad. He has a Golden Knight that just shreds my archers. He has a Lightning that gets a lot of value. He has an E-Giant that I need to axe on defense every time for. So yeah, it kind of sucks. Gonna go for archers on it. I was gonna Phoenix the back, but he played a Barbrail, so I kind of had the archers on it. Okay, if he goes Phoenix in the back, I'm going to poison. Actually, I don't really want to. I want to, but at the same time, I don't really want to because he might go um, E-Giant and a Golden Knight with it. That's like an undefendable push. So I'm going to have to watch out. I'm going to Miner in the middle, like over here, so you won't really be able to nade ability me. Oh, that was a really good Lightning. I can't even lie. He tried to catch me off guard with that, but the Ice Spirit was really good on my end. He popped the ability way too soon, in my opinion. He should have kind of waited on the ability, I guess, but... I don't know. I'm not going to be able to get a lock here anyways. I'll try to go in because I know he's not back to a E-Giant. I mean, he is, but he won't be able to afford it. But I'm not going to get a lock. Wait, what? Wait, why do you let it lock on? Okay, you know what? I'm not going to complain. I'll take the damage. I don't know why he let it lock on, though. He had enough looks to defend it. But I'm just going to Phoenix on the cannon. Don't really have to worry about the Barbrail getting a shot on my tower. going to go for a Miner. Just going to poison like into the tower. Kind of had to miss that one Archer because I had to hit whatever he was going to place on the Miner. And kind of had a feeling he would place the Golden Knight in the back because I know that he's not back to NATO. So he probably thought I was going to play the Miner in the back. Good predict, though, but didn't work out for him. Gonna go for arches in the back on the right side because the golden knight is on the opposite lane so i don't really have to worry about the dash right now i'm just gonna go for a minor opposite lane to kite it right now and then just gonna go for like a phoenix on the bar barrel and yeah just gonna knight not gonna expo on this because i kind of need maxwell for the next e-giant i know he's back to e-giant already so kind of need it for that but yeah gonna log the e-giant back and yeah really good defense probably gonna play that poison like a tile lower to kind of help out more but it's okay it did its job so i don't really care what happens to it Okay, I can't really expo that either because he popped the ability on it. So it's really annoying. Gonna archers over here to not let him nato. If he natos, I think only one of them die. Now, I could have placed that better, to be honest. Like, I could have made it so that, like, none of them died, but it's okay. Hopefully, no ability. Oh my god, of course he gets to an ability. That is so annoying. I was winning by a lot, but he just got back to a second golden knight ability out of nowhere. So, kind of losing right now. Okay, gonna have to expo on defense for this. Hopefully, that locks on the phoenix. Beautiful. And then just gonna have to log Ice Spirit predict the archers. He's gonna play it on the side over there. Oh my god, why did that hop on the egg? Yikes. That is so bad. I think the Golden Knight's gonna make it to my tower and I lose the game now. I even knew like what he was up to and I still couldn't do anything because I um my Ice Spirit jumped on the egg and yeah, I took so much damage right now. <laughs> and he also played a lightning, so yeah, I think I lost the game. I'll try to come back though. I mean lightning doesn't really do 347, does it? I don't think so. It does like 320 or something. But that's a lightning poison though, or lightning nato, not a poison. So just gonna have to minor in front, gonna have to go for, uh, I guess log because he played the arches into it. Just gonna go for an expo in the middle over here. Oh, my phoenix respawned and it killed the phoenix and the egg also died to my log. So I'm just gonna poison again, just gonna go for a minor. Don't nato me. Don't nato me. Nah, okay, whatever. It's alright. I kind of lost because I couldn't like get the ice spear on the archers, but that's okay. All right, I'm in a match here. Nine and one at the moment, so I'll try my best. I'm gonna try to not lose another game. I'm gonna arches in the back here to cycle, see what he does. Okay, I was gonna minor, but I'm just gonna expo now because he played a flying machine in the back. That's a pretty good counter to my expo. I can't really fireball that off, so just gonna have to kind of take advantage of that. Okay, I tried to click my knight like on the archers, but it didn't go off. It's okay though. I'm gonna phoenix on the on the flying machine and see what he does here. Might go for like a scar me on the phoenix egg. So I'm gonna go minor to like. Get the Skarmy out and then just gonna log out the Skarmy right now. Oh, a little bit too late on that. I should have known to log like a little bit faster. Yikes. That's kind of annoying, but it's okay. Gonna knight the middle. He kind of wasted that because he couldn't really get it down before the Skellies died. I think he also had the elixir for it, but he just couldn't get it down on time because my log was really fast. I was meant to be a prediction log, but he probably thought I was gonna log once I saw the Skarmy. So yeah, I kind of wasted that Skelly King. I'll take it for sure. Might go for like a flying machine on it. Never mind, goes for minor, not bad. That's kind of better for me, not gonna lie, because he didn't minor on my tower, so I don't really have to, like, 
over defend that. Just gonna have to arches on this and then kind of want to expo again. Okay, I'm just gonna poison that out. I'm not gonna expo that. Might walk out of the poison, but it doesn't matter. Archer should help out on killing that. Okay, never mind. It's gonna stay on one HP, get one hit on my tower, but I can definitely afford to eat that for now. I'm up a lot of damage right now, so gonna go for uh ice spear. Just gonna go for like a minor in the middle to distract more. Gonna go for a knight in the middle opposite to distract even more. Okay, this could get awkward if he goes for like a skelly king on the left right now, but yikes, he does go for it. Gonna arches in the middle, just gonna go for like a ice spear at the back here to pull it back. And of course, it doesn't want to come back. It's okay though. Gonna log over here. How did that knight get no damage? Oh, there's an archer. Yeah, I forget about the archer. But it's okay. My phoenix is going to respawn. I take that back. It's not gonna respawn. He played arrows, so. I'm gonna have to think of a way to get damage here. I might have to go for like a minor poison with the axe spell. I'm not really too sure, but just gonna have to axe spell right now though. I wanna kinda bait the minion ward on my axe spell. Loki, is he gonna go for it? Nope, he's gonna go for a minor. Might go mortar in the middle now. Oh wait, no, he's back to Skelly King, so I might go for it. I'm gonna knight the middle to distract both. I could go for a poison on the Skelly King and the Archer, but don't really wanna do that because I know he's gonna mortar in the middle, so just gonna minor and then go poison on the mortar and the tower. Nice, this way I get a lock, like a tiny lock, and I also get more damage. Plays a flying machine, so I think everyone knows what's coming now. He's gonna hoard here, so. Gonna go for like an archers on the side, just gonna go for an ice spear, and just gonna phoenix over here to kill the flying machine. And then, yeah, the horde should get knocked back by the egg thing, and then, yeah, should die. Alright, yeah, I'll take it. Gonna go for an expo, just gonna go for like a knight to block the skelly king and the archers. Didn't really go for it, he played it low, not bad, I guess. I'm just gonna log that out. I don't really care about the ability. You can pop it if you want, but that's not gonna do anything. Except for kind of like stall max out a little, I guess. But yeah. Nice, pretty decent ability, I guess. Gonna minor here. He has the archers like low to distract the mortar and kill the miner. And yet the miner on defense. That's so good for me. Gonna expo again. And just gonna log once I have log back. Which I do right now, so I'm just gonna do it right now. Might pop the ability on the skeleton king again. I don't think he can afford to actually. Because if he does, I think I win. Expo should lock on if he does. Okay, yeah, he couldn't pop the ability. That's good. I'm gonna go for a miner in the back. Might be back to Skarmy or something, but really good archers on his end to kill my Expo. Okay, yeah, he didn't go for the Skarmy because he knew I was gonna poison it if he did. So I'm just gonna Expo again. Just gonna bait out the Skelly King. Gonna go for a knight again. Just gonna log. Yeah, do all of this, all of that, and then just gonna go for, like, archers. And, yeah, that should die. The Expo should take care of the Skellies from the ability. Or not. Never mind, the archers died to the arrows, so I'm not really going to be able to get a lock here. A little bit annoying, but it's okay. Gonna minor poison here, so he can't really scar me into all this. He might still go for it, though. Minor on defense. Okay, that's kind of smart. He did end up catching the miner, so I'm not really going to get any damage from that. Gonna predict a flying machine in the middle, and that was kind of unfortunate, because he held on to it. This guy's kind of playing smart. I'm going to log on the scar me he's about to play. Nice. He played at the bridge, though. I don't really know why he played at the bridge and not the miner, but... It doesn't matter to me. I hit it anyway, so it doesn't matter. Really good poison on my end, putting it into the Skelly King ability. I'm going to go for a Phoenix on the Horde. That way, the spawn damage is going to, like, damage out the Horde, and I'm not really going to take any damage here. going to go for a Minor Poison. He's been catching all my Miners right now. Every time he has a Ground card, he caught my Miner, I think, so I'm not really playing that smart with the Miners, I guess. Just going to go for a Knight. going to go for, like, a Phoenix right about now. going to poison all this, and then just going to go for a Miner and a Log. Do I even need the log? I don't think so. I'm just going to minor log though. It doesn't matter. Nice. Finally got the miner on the tower. So I'll take the win. He kind of played well. I'm not going to lie. But I just had a matchup I think. So I'll take the win. That's going to put me at 10-1. and one, So I just got to win two more. I'll see you when I find a game. Alright I'm in a match. I'm 10-1 and one right now. So see what deck he's playing. I'm just going to go for a log to cycle. Oh wait. This guy's a lava one trick. I face this guy on ladder a lot. I think he also knows that I play Expo 3.0. So might try to, I don't know, go for some cheeky plays. I'm going to knight the bridge here. I'm going to make it seem like I'm playing Expo right now. So he kind of like fumbles in the first attack. Because he might try to predict like my archers or like, I don't know, my Tesla or something. A lot of people like to like eye drag in the middle or like minor in the middle to predict the Tesla. But he might just go minor on the archers though. I don't really know. I'm going to predict it on the archers. Oh my god. Yep, he does the same thing I was talking about. Going to Phoenix here and just going to go for a poison. And I should not take any damage, right? Might take one balloon hit, actually, because that poison was kind of early. Uh, does it get one shot? Oh, that was so close. Thank God it didn't get one shot. That makes it super easy for me to defend the next lava, because I do have archers and cycles. So all I got to do is I get to a phoenix again and just going to have to poison on defense. Probably going to have to go for like an ice spirit, but 
I'm gonna have to think of a way to take the tower down without forcing out the eye drag, because I don't really want him to like eye drag into my into my axe bow. Wait, this guy's a dumbass. What are you doing? You're not even back to arrows. <laughs> what? What was that play? That was so bad. Alright, I win now, because he can't do anything. Dude played like absolute um terrible. So just gonna go for Phoenix on the lava and yeah. Wait, he might have given up. I know he's got like seven elixir right now, but he's not really playing anything right now. Okay, let's see if he wants to go opposite lane with the balloon. Might actually do it. I'm going to minor with this to force something out. I think he gave up, though. He should be leaking right now. Yeah, he definitely gave up. Yeah, okay, nice. Really easy win. So that puts me at 11-1. and one. I will see you when I find a game. Just going to cut it. Okay, on to my last game here. I'm um, going to try to get the 12 win. Just going to go for like an Ice Spirit to cycle. Okay, really good cycle. Okay, just had to make sure my recording was on because I waited for like half an hour to find this game. Just going to go for a uh, Knight on the side. Like right over here. So if he goes Golden Knight with it, he's not really going to be able to snipe out my... Um, or dash into my Archer and the tower. Arrows and a Ghost. I don't really know what deck this could be. Bandit, okay. Uh... P.E.K.K.A. maybe? P.E.K.K.A. with arrows? That's pretty popular right now. A lot of people play arrows in P.E.K.K.A. now because of archers, but I could be wrong. Could also be a different deck. Magic Archer. Could also be like a bridge spam deck, though. I don't really know, but I guess we'll find out. Gonna go for an Ice Spirit again because I'm back to it. I'm gonna have to wait till I have 10 Elixir, though. Okay, gonna play it in the back now because I kind of need it for the ram. Gonna have to go for a Miner right now on defense and then just gonna... See if I need to, like, kill the Marcher if he goes for it. I don't think he has a Marcher, but if he does, I'm going to have to kill it somehow. So, just going to Axe Ball on the left right now. And um, he should go for, like, a Bandit on this. A Ghost. Okay, just going to have to go for, like, a Knight right now. Oh, that's so good that the Bandit didn't dash into my Axe Bow. Might have to zap that to kill the Axe Bow, Loki. Nice. All right, so the Axe Bow is going to help out with the P.E.K.K.A. because he played a Zap. That Zap was so bad for him because he should have just kind of let the Bandit kill the... Expo and then try to go for like a, I don't know, Marcher or something on the right side, but yeah, he just kind of lost all the damage and took all that damage. That sounded kind of dumb, but what I meant to say is that he lost all that damage for no reason. I mean, he could have gotten some back and then like some back later on to even out the game, but now it's just impossible because I'm up like a whole like 1500. I should not sell this lead. If I do, I'm going to be really upset, but yeah, I'll try my best. Going to go for uh, Arches in the back here to cycle. He does have arrows though. It could get awkward if like at some point he gets a really big push and I don't really have like axe bond defense. Could get awkward. I'm kind of scared of that ram, so I'm gonna log it back. When you don't have a defensive building in your deck like a cannon or like a bomb tower, it kind of gets awkward when they play the win condition in the back because especially something like a uh, battle ram, it just gets kind of fast. So yeah, you're gonna have to watch out for that. But just gonna have to go for like an ice bear on the pack out here. Gonna go for a poison, and that should all die. I think I don't really have to play anything on the pack out, do I? Hopefully not. Ooh, really bad archers. Okay, I'm gonna take a pack of hit. Oh my god, ah! I'm choking, I'm choking. I'm gonna go for a knight here and uh, Michael Marcher, so I'm gonna predict it. Ice Spirit High. Okay, he's not gonna do it now. He was kind of self aware that I was gonna predict, so he didn't um, end up playing it. Okay, looks like he kind of came back because I kind of sold the game. I let him have like a pack of hit and now he's kind of evened out. So goes for pack in the back. Kind of needed that defensive axe because I don't think he has a big spell. He's got arrows and his zap, so. Should be fine. I'm going to have to cook up like a really good um, miner here because he might snipe out my phoenix. Going to have to watch out for that. Just going to go ice spirit, going to knight here, and then I'm back to miner. So I'm just going to miner over here predicting a marcher on the phoenix. Pekka go back. Does play a marcher. Nice. Log. Lock on the ram. Yo, why is nothing on the ram? Oh my god. No, 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 no. Not like this. Not like this. Don't zap. Oh god, he zapped. Oh, okay. I'm taking so much damage right now, but... I should be able to win here. Hopefully, though. I don't really know if I'll be able to win here, but hopefully should be able to win here. Gonna knight. Does he have enough for P.E.K.K.A.? Should not have enough for P.E.K.K.A. Okay, he might have enough, like, now. Yeah, definitely gonna have enough now, though. Gonna log here. Oh, I could have saved that egg. Annoying. Gonna go for a uh, Phoenix right now. Nice. He couldn't snipe my Expo. That's good. Gonna go for a Miner behind the tower. Gonna go for, like, an Ice Spear right now to make him defend the Expo more. He has to ram in the middle. He was... Okay. Poison out that E was on the bandit. That should get knocked back. So I think the bandit also like completely dies to that. I think. Do I have to log that? Yeah, I do. Okay, I had to log it. So kind of unfortunate. But just going to have to expo again. How's he catching up on damage? This is actually so annoying. I'm like getting damage. But he's also getting damage. I don't know how. Going to go for a knight up high to not let him snipe. Going to go for like a minor poison right now. 
because I kind of want to go for it. Yeah, that's a really good poison on the Pekka and the Ram. And it's like triple elixir, doesn't matter how the how I play the poison. I just have to kind of be careful. Gonna go for a Phoenix. Uh gonna minor again. Oh my god. He's got two Pekkas. You know what? I'm just gonna I'm just gonna stick to my OG plan. Just gonna go minor poison. And he caught the minor, so I think I lost. I need a I need a expo in the middle like right now. Lock on the lock on the marcher. Nice. No more, no more. Okay, that's fine. I'm alive, I'm alive. Gonna archer in the middle. Gonna have to knight here because the bandit might make it. Okay. Gonna wait. I'm gonna have to log and then go poison. Michael Marcher, don't snipe. Okay, alright. That was so close. But I got the poison log down on time. So I'll take the win. I'm just gonna end the video there. I love you guys. Bye. Wait, I'm gonna open the chest and then end the video. Okay, yeah, nothing good from this. Not even a legendary, but love you guys. Bye.